What is up you guys? Welcome back to our channel! Today is my cutie patootie's wife's birthday today. Real birthday, we're celebrating it this weekend because we're going out of town, not necessarily out of town, but we are going to Park City to celebrate her birthday. I hate my birthday. Why? <laughs> I don't hate it, but I don't like it. I don't like it when everyone texts me because I'm really bad at responding to people's texts or Instagram messages. And I don't like people giving me presents. And Abby would ask me what I wanted to do today and I told her that I wanted to get an oil change for her car and she won't let me. Because who wants to get an oil change for the car for their birthday? Because you That's need one. <laughs> anyway, but I've settled on. Instead, we are going to go get our, what do you call it? A baby, baby registry. registry set up. We're going to Tarjay. Hey, hey, hey. Abby still thinks it's dumb that we're doing that on my well, birthday, but. Yeah, because it's your birthday. I keep asking her what she wanted to do and she wanted to go set up her baby registry. So we're getting the baby registry ready today for our baby shower that will be next so month. Fun. Julia still has all of her work crap in the car because she took my car when she went to work last. But we are stopping to get some food. Where are we going? The Habit? We're going to the Habit Burger Girl. We're gonna yes. get some burgers. No, we usually get salads when we go there. Yeah. And their chocolate shake is really good. I think that's where I got that chocolate shake oh, that I yeah. keep talking about. Okay, so we're gonna see if they have one. We'll I that. hope that that's the good chocolate shake I'm thinking of. And then we can go set up our baby registry. I'm so excited. I don't know why I'm so excited. Yeah, it's just why like is so such fun. A fun thing? And we already have so much stuff, so we're just putting like little stuff because we don't want people to, like it's mostly gonna be family. The baby registry is really just for our family that want to give us a gift. And we're just gonna be putting little stuff because we don't want our family to like buy us the like big expensive stuff. So it's gonna just be like, I don't know, diapers and wipes and yeah. Yeah, if you're a mom though, let me know what your favorite type of diaper is because how am I supposed to know? Yeah, I have Because no I want to put diapers and wipes and stuff so that we have them like stocked up for when he's here. But also right. I know nothing about diapers and wipes. Right. So this should be interesting. All right. Oh, try the shake. You can't deny oh, that fun. that looks yummy. Mmm. I think that's it. <clears throat> I think that's it. Yeah. Let me try. So. It's like almost like chocolate milky kind of. Mmm. You know what I mean? Yeah. Happy birthday, cutest. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna tell them about when we went to Olive Garden. This was before we did YouTube or anything. I, I, I always, we always get Olive Garden for my birthday because I mm -hmm. love Olive Garden. Well, no, babe. We yeah. went to Olive Garden for my birthday. This was before COVID, so we were sitting indoors. Mm -hmm. And this um, was like five years ago. The waiter came over and he brought me a cake, which he charged me for, by the way. No, he brought over three cakes, remember? Yeah, I don't know why. Because we told, we mentioned that it was my birthday. And then he brought him. over like two appetizers two, without asking. Without asking, he just brought us over a bunch of extra food and then charged us for it. And then he sat down in the booth with us and started singing happy birthday to me and making really direct eye contact. But he was really intense. Happy birthday. I'll insert the Snapchat. It was really weird. It birthday to you. Happy birthday to Julia. Happy birthday, dear Julia. And then he went to light the candle on the little birthday cake that he brought that he charged us for. And then he, but he was like a foot away. Yeah, he was like lighting like The candle it. was right here and he was like way over here. And he was like, oh, these dang candles won't light. Like, and we were, it was so awkward because we were like, it's right in front of you. I think I don't he know. was or it was, drunk, it was I don't weird. know. I'm not really sure what to put on here for like clothes wise. Cause what if they're like not out here still? Oh look at this little fedora. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's cute. A little sweaters. I think, I mean if they if they sell out that's fine. But yeah. maybe. This mask will not stay on my face. You have too small a face. I've been over this before. Gotta put sockies on there. <laughs> Nipple balm. Oh yeah, perfect. Nipple balm. Yeah. That's what everyone wants to think about as they're buying us gifts is our nipples. Yeah. <laughs> I wish that I had done more research before we got here. Cause like even just looking at like the diapers, like I don't know like we what are good diapers. Like we do have a little bit of an idea, but not like I don't know. Oh it's stressful because you want to get like the best things, right?
I feel like we have a good amount of stuff. I can't think of anything else. We got like little medicines and things. Yeah. But also we can add stuff online if like we forgot mm -hmm. stuff too, but that was fun. Yeah, it was really fun. I can't believe wow. that we're gonna own these things and also own a baby. Oh gosh, <laughs> I'm scared. Okay, you guys, that was crazy. I feel like it's just like, makes it much more real that like we're it gonna really have does. a baby. Yeah. But one thing that one person that someone said is don't get like stuff like clothes that are a little bit older. You yeah, know? so we got like some six month clothes. So we tried to do that because it's really tempting to just get newborn stuff. Yeah, because you want like a bunch of newborn stuff. Right. But I don't know, we tried to get like a good amount of stuff. Hopefully it's good, but we are also going to run over to Dick's because Julia wants a metal detector. I swear I said I want it for my birthday. We also, while we were in Target, I got a bra because Nothing fits. Yeah, she had a panic attack this morning. Yeah. You guys didn't get to see that, but she was Sorry. Like, no. Problem is my rib cage is widening so much to fit my organs since I have a baby in there now that it's just so tight and so uncomfortable. So I found something that I think will be a little bit more comfortable for me and I made Julia get a cute sweater that I thought she would look cute in. Cause she's a cute girl. Anyway. I'm to wear it though. Off to Dick's to find a metal detector. This is a little off brand for us. We've never been in a sports store. <laughs> I don't know anything about I don't about. think we've ever watched sports in our life. No. I don't know anything about these. We can't find anything. Huh. <laughs> I didn't have it. Anyways, but I don't think there's anywhere like to go We're buy gonna them. We're going to have to get them off Amazon. We're gonna have to get, get them. them. Off One. We don't need multiple. So I guess no metal detecting for me today. I love you. No, you. Gay. Julia has the worst hiccups right now. But this is the sweater that I made her get. I think it's so cute. I just feel like it looks like her. It looks like a Julia sweater. <gasps> and we also got natural deodorant. I've always wanted to try something like this. I thought the smell would be stronger, but it's not. Now I'm just like, I feel like that tired me out. Do you feel like that tired you out? Yeah, I'm super tired. I want to try my sweater on. Okay. Cute. I'm going to sit here for a minute. There's a couple work things that I need to do really quick. And then I'll probably change because I just... I'm so uncomfortable, you guys. Like, I can't even tell you. Baby? What? Can you get my laptop for me? Yes. Anything for my princess. Thanks, baby. You mean horse? Horse. So I just finished up doing a few work things and I think our channel name is going to change because if you've been following our channel for a while, I used to just post videos of just like stuff that I would do, but then it kind of is like, it's a, our channel now, obviously like a couple's channel. So we are going to change our channel name. I've been seeing your guys' comments about how it should be Julie and Abby. So just trying to decide what would be best for us to rename it. So if you're seeing this, we probably changed it and just make a mental note because it probably will not just be under my name anymore. You being silly? Thanks being silly. You being silly? I wonder if he spills a little bit high. They said it would take 48 hours. I don't think so. Out. Are you so high from the drugs, Frank? Freaky. Anyway, the channel name has probably changed, which will be super fun. I don't know what we should make it yet, but I mean, we always say Abby and Julia like in our intro, yeah. in our banner. Yeah, Just I don't know, Julia. but go check it out if it's already done, which it should be. Now that that's done, the house is an actual disaster. Are you gonna help me clean even though it's your birthday? No? No. Nope. Your, nope. your sweater is kind of long on you. <laughs> Yeah, I told you it was big. This is an extra small. Really? Yeah. Oh, maybe it's a I sweater it's dress? I think supposed to be like a big Oh, small. maybe you're supposed to like French tuck? I don't know. Okay. Okay. Nobody wants to see that. <laughs> That's much better. Julia's over there doing her voting stuff. Frank's sitting on a couch like a cutie. Dean's being annoying per usual. <laughs> Where's your toy? Go get your toy. No, you have one out. It's somewhere around here. Thanks for cleaning, babe. What? Thanks for cleaning. You're welcome. <laughs> I helped her clean. I really did. I feel like Addie films herself cleaning a lot and it looks like I never clean, but I clean. Sure. 
<laughs> so a lot of you are probably wondering what exactly our plan is with the baby registry. Like, are we having a baby shower in COVID season? Well, yes, but we're gonna be doing a COVID safe baby shower. It's, this, this whole pregnancy has been kind of rough because like, whenever I read books and we talk, it talks about like pregnancy, like your hormones change, right? And there's the saying, it takes a village, right? Because you surround yourself with people that help you and we can't do that right now. Our family, our friends, people haven't really seen Abby or me really that much because of COVID and we've been like really, really careful. It's just important that we're careful and that we don't get the coronavirus or spread it to anybody else. But because of that, we haven't seen really any family members and it's been like rough on mental health. So our plan is we're gonna have like an open house style baby shower. Yes, masks, social distancing, all of that. And we won't have everybody there at once. It'll be people filtering in and out. That way there'll only be like a couple of people ever like at the same time. So that's our plan right now. Let me know what you guys think. I don't know. I'm nervous about the whole thing because we're just so like, we just wanna be really careful, you know? I feel like I'm rambling. Hey babe. What? Do you want to order Olive Garden and go pick Hell it up? Yeah, I do. All right, you better. Oh my gosh. Bring me an Olive Garden. What are you gonna get? Okay, well you gotta go to your phone and you gotta order it so that we can pick it up. What'd you do with my? I put it in the junk drawer. <laughs> Alfredo. It's just, it's just a classic. You know, you can't go wrong with it. Every time we get Olive Garden, I always think about trying, sorry, it's hard for me to talk right now because my mouth is watering so bad. Every time we get Olive Garden, I always think that I want to try something new, but then it's like, what if it's not as good? You know, breadsticks. I ordered extra breadsticks and some Alfredo dipping sauce because mama loves her breadsticks. And then of course, the classic Olive Garden salad. You know, I'm gonna be eating those pepperoncinis up in there. How was your Olive Garden? It was amazing. Yeah. And I'm just feeling so blessed to have such a, a wife that gets me Olive Garden for my birthday yeah. every Julia's year. Julia's working on my presets for my new Instagram They're blow ready. up. Okay. They're ready? Yeah, I'm still. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Thanks, baby. I got a good wifey. I got a good wifey. No, I got a good wifey. No, I do. Okay, Julia got my presets figured out and I'm so excited. I have them all in my like little grid thing that like shows like my Instagram and i love them so much i'm so excited i've been needing a change and wanting a change so also let me show you this video that my dad sent for julia for her birthday happy, happy birthday, birthday. <laughs> it's so funny i don't know why it's so funny but yeah that is pretty much it i ate a little bit of the olive garden not that much but you're missing out it was okay i just I'm not a pasta person. For some reason, like, I grew up, like, eating, like, salads and stuff. We leave for Park City on Saturday. It is Thursday today, so... So when you see this... We'll probably be... Oh, yeah, we will. We'll be leaving for Park City, so stay tuned for those vlogs because that's going to be really fun. Mm -hmm. Since we couldn't go on a baby moon, our plan was to, like, go somewhere really fun, like Bahamas or Hawaii, but obviously that's just not going to happen this year, which is really, really sad because I was looking forward to, like, a really awesome baby moon before we become moms, but that's gonna be our impromptu. Yeah. We'll probably well, just I... get like a takeout dinner. It's not gonna be anything crazy. We got like a room with like its own hot tub. So we're just gonna relax, enjoy each other's hot company. Hot tub on a balcony. Yeah, very romantic. So it's gonna be romantic and fun. So stay tuned for those videos. Mm -hmm. We also have a few more planning we need to do for our baby shower and stuff. So if you wanna see our baby shower and everything, Make sure to subscribe because we have a lot of fun stuff coming. Today's notification shout out goes to Jane Barnett. We love you! She also has a baby name guest. Should we 
talk about it in the video. She says oh. that she thinks the baby's name is Hagen, which actually is a pretty cute name, but it's not Hagen. I'm sorry. so sorry, Jane. That is pretty much it for our video. Thanks so much. If you guys want a notification shout out, all you gotta do is click that little bell. Ding, ding. Let us know that you did it and you might be in our next video. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.